Hey, what's poppin' guys? Sizzle here, and I just need to get this off my chest. This is the stupidest YouTube comment. I've I've read, like, I, I get about one to five comments or replies to my comments per day on YouTube for at least the last year, if not longer. Uh, and, and this is still, two dates, probably the stupidest YouTube comment I've ever read. And I just, I need to get it out there. It's been living in my head rent-free for last month every time I see this Life Weaver character. I'm just reminded of it. Like, every time I go onto Life Weaver, let's pretend this bot here is Life Weaver. Like, every time I go like this, and he just pedals up there. Or every time I go like that, and he pulls over his teammates. Or every time I go like that, and he just hits me like a little dash back. Right, he gets me the, the old 1-2. I'm reminded of this YouTube comment that said, Life Weaver, this character right here, this, this man right here, has no mobility. None. Not like, a little mobility, or less mobility than other heroes like Mercy or Lucio who I, I will admit they have more mobility than Life Weaver but beyond Mercy and Lucio who has this right this brings you from there to there nice big vertical mobility keeps you super safe that pedal almost never gets broken has a lot of health the range to be able to heal from like way up here even back here kind of through stuff as well like if I go around through the wall it'll still auto heal through the wall that's still connected by the way like, we can let that guy, you can see he's on yellow. If I go heal through the wall, you can see he went green. It heals through the wall. It's auto-aim, heal through the wall. I can aim this far away, and it'll heal, heal that guy. Like, he has that, he has this, right? And then he has also this dash right here. All of which I would consider decent mobility. I mean, he was comparing to other supports outside of these two. Which I will say, Mercy Lucio, they have more mobility. But you're telling me Moira, the character who can't jump up here has more mobility. The character who's with with the left shift can probably go from like here to like there, like where my crosshair is. Right? It's you tell me that's more mobility than Life Weaver? Maybe horizontally, maybe. Uh but that's like if you do like the jump and stuff. I don't know. I don't really think Moira has more. That's that one's more debatable. My bad Zenyatta. He literally could just walk around. He doesn't have anything. Ana. Literally nothing. But what about a character people say has really solid mobility? Baptiste here. What can Bap do in terms of mobility? Oh, he can jump from here to here. I wonder what other character can do that. I wonder if that'd be considered decent mobility. <laughs> That's all his mobility. What about Brig? I mean, she doesn't have a lot of mobility options, but she has one. She goes from here to here on a, on a five second cooldown. I do wonder if there's any other characters that can go from there to there on a five second cooldown. It's, uh... I don't know. It's a real mystery for me. Let's we'll see who can do that or who can, you know, get up on this high ground with, with one little quick button press. I don't know. Could be anyone. <laughs> or what about Alari? She's got decent ish mobility. She can go from like here to here. That's pretty cool. What about someone who can go up there and also make the distance from here to there? I mean, it is two abilities, but he has both of them. <laughs> And then I guess Kiriko might also be that because I mean this is this is just almost as ridiculous as the life we were. It's actually more ridiculous than the life we were healing, being able to TP through walls like that, and then you know, wall climb and all that. But even then, I mean, life we were is kind of close. If it wasn't for teleport, I think life we were destroy. I mean, because outside teleport, she says wall climb, which is solid, but it's not as good as pedal. <laughs> it's not gonna be that pedal. And then saying he has to play safe or he like dies a lot. That's that's a whole nother thing. What the hell just happened there? But saying like, oh yeah, like a Winston dived me, I can't just like, go like this and be back to full health, because that heals you for like 50, by the way. And then saying you have like, no survivability, no damage, or whatever. I don't know. I think it's kind of insane. Saying when you dove, you can't just do this, and pull over like, a Reaper, or your tank or something, to make you live. Like, there's many, many games where I'm in the high elo, the life weavers, even the losing life weavers on the enemy team that lost, that lose the game, will have like one death in the whole game. There are life weavers who average less deaths than Wrecking Ball, who is notorious for not dying but also accomplishing nothing sometimes. But like, you're really gonna tell me this was a real? Com I'm, I'm sure this guy has never watched a video beyond the one he commented on or whatever from me. But this comment has been living rent free in my head for a month. Every time I see a life weaver, I'm reminded of this shit. I, I just really need to get that out there. I need to let the world know that I had to read this, and you, now you do too. <laughs> There's a lot of dog shit takes out there, but I, I do think this one might take the cake.
Uh, with that being said, I, I guess I hope y'all enjoyed. I don't really know what the point of this video was. I just needed to get this out there. It was almost like therapy for me. Alright, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great rest of your day.